Hello my friends, welcome back to my Crafty Corner and in this video, guess what? Here is um, BB Craft project share number one. Thank you so much again for BB Craft. Um, um, they let me promote their products and uh, I'm pretty sure you know um, BB Craft has a YouTube um, program. If you have a um, hundred or more subscriber, you might eligible to subscribe their program and you will able to pick up some products and do some project shares. And I think um, both way, hopefully, okay. I will leave the program in the description below as well as I what I use today. And if you watched um, my <clears throat> what I picked up, you know, one of the items was this beautiful, gorgeous jelly vinyl. And I would like to be honest, right away after the video, I started to play with it because I had to, <laughs> right? So, but because I don't want to ruin any jelly uh, vinyl, first I made, um, okay, so the story started with, <laughs> I watched a YouTube video. It's about seven, eight years old. And what the lady did with her vinyl actually is just, I think is absolutely adorable and I wanted to try with my vinyl and this is not the exact size what she used but I'm still so satisfied so what I did first I wanted to make it from just you know regular vinyl to try it if my conception will work so I ended up made this adorable little vinyl bag of course with closure as you can see i used the hobby lobby full letter and all the all the what's the name um findings are from my stash so this is what i made this was the original <coughs> idea i wanted to try and then I thought, <clears throat> okay, I was so nervous. I don't want to ruin the jelly vinyl. So, <clears throat> of course, when I made it, even I know um, I made a lot of mistakes. I learned <clears throat> a few things, but of course, I still made some when I made this one. But I love, love, love how adorable is this. As you can see, um, the first one I put three, then I um, realized I would like to add some kind of handle to it. So, and this time I put two of this, <clears throat> if I can show you, those adorable little gem. Um, I think the name is Rivet. Um, unfortunately, I don't have just like this. But it's like little spikes on the on the gem. I don't know I'm, a, I'm in a corner or I'm in the frame or not. And I try to show you how it looks like the bottom. So if you can see, those are little four spikes. And <clears throat> I put it and the third one is um, just a regular um, eyelet. And I added this adorable... Uh, handle to it and as you can see this is um, how to say it's a you know the closure is different than this one but I love this closure so much and I had to try it and as you can see it's pretty spacious my plan is adding a little mini album in this bag and I absolutely love, love, love it. So here is the handle. And then I said, okay, but I would like to go back with the original conception with, you know, this closure. So I went back and I made a blue one. The only difference is, as you can see, here is the, if I, do you see it? I'm not sure, I'm sorry, I don't see, but I have to show you. But these are, the, this is the sides. 
both sides. I'm sorry, but it's the the vinyl is very um, <clears throat> what's the name? It's like magnet. <laughs> Seriously. So, but this time I I made a, an other like a little handle here, not just this like a purse type of um, handle like I did here. I did this one too. I added this one too and the closure is exactly the same as my original the template I made and I think turned out so 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 adorable and I added this layered bow as you can see one is uh, I hope you can see <laughs> because the whole thing is shiny so it's it's actually gold and I added the glitter and on the top I added this adorable little jellies next to it so this is my first week um jelly vinyl project share and <laughs> I can wait to the uh, project share number two so stay tuned thank you so much for watching and please let me know which one is your favorite okay thank you so much bye Okay, my friends, welcome back because you know what happened? I totally forgot the last thing I made with this vinyl. Uh, <clears throat> you know, this is so me. <laughs> I'm sorry, but uh, when I played with this, I said, um, maybe if I would like to add something more, um, because, you know, you put in the in a mini album or you can add a lot of things but what if I make a little oh my gosh what's this <clears throat> you know a pencil holder so I made a little pencil holder I use this adorable um, what's the name snap so actually you can close and open it or is a pen have a pen this is obviously longer but I tried several things and it's totally fit as you can see but maybe I should try something different wait a second <clears throat> okay I have this Nuvo clear marker pen this is looks like a good size or at least a better size but as you can see it's perfectly fit perfectly fit and um, I don't want to close it, but maybe like this, I can. But, you know, you have to find the perfect size. Actually, I tried with the Sharpie. And, of course, I don't see the Sharpie right now in my, in my table. But I put this little Ikea pencil. And I don't see my Sharpie anyway. So, you can add your keychain or whatever and I added as you can see someone gifted this to me and okay I will add in this but obviously it's fit with, with all and you can just basically put it in your bag good to go right so because all, all the same size Obviously, it fits all the other bags, but this one you can see a little bit more how perfectly fit. So now I ended up <laughs> with my videos. Bye.